One we are doing number 17 in our 5th grade PSSA packet. Kelly spends 5 hours making pizzas. Each pizza takes her 1 fourth of an hour to make. When she is finished, all of the pizzas are shared equally among 6 families. How many pizzas does each family receive? We have 4 possible answers for this problem. A. 5 24th. B. 3 tenths. C, three and one third, or D, seven and a half. So now we are going to underline the important information. So Kelly spends five hours making pizzas. Each pizza takes her one fourth an hour to make. Uh, the pizzas are shared equally among six families. So let's write the problem. And then five and then you're gonna okay, come on, come on, divided on, by yeah. one fourth um, because she has five table. hours and each pizza Wait, takes her one fourth of an hour to make. You know so an easy way to do Wait, this no, is make five Please. into That's a fraction like this. So a fraction for five would be fraction would a fra five is a fraction would be five over one. And you take the division Wait. sign to make it multiplication. Never mind. Oh. Wait, and okay, so one fourth Never mind. Would, would be um, change one fourth and I you make it vice versa for four but over one. It. Now we're gonna do cross multiplication. So instead. we'll I don't do care five times I'm, four, I'm which Chinese. equals twenty. Wow. And then one times Sorry. one, which Wait, equals you care about one. The Twenty over one okay, is e equal to twenty. Oh, found it! I skipped over it. Now we know that Kelly made twenty pizzas in that four five hours she had. So now we are going to erase this, so we have more space to work. So now, because Kelly has made 20 pizzas and well, she's sharing them among six families, oh, exactly. we have to do 20 divided by 6. <laughs> and we're going to do oh, long no, division. No, no. So 6 happen. goes into 2 zero times, and it would be 6. So 2 what minus... Is that laser cutter? Six goes into two, zero times, and zero times six equals zero. And two minus zero equals two. And then you bring down your zero. Six goes into twenty three times, and three times six equals eighteen. Now twenty minus eighteen equals two. So. So we have the remainder. <laughs> like laser cutter. Two. Out. Okay. Real quick, can I? Laser cutter. <laughs> now we have to turn cutter. remainder we two to, into a fraction. Oh my God, so to do we that, you, you take the remainder it. two and, and it. put it over no. the six right no, here. No, the recording you did. In a fraction. No, that's fine, Samantha. So now we have two six. And two six simplified is... One third. And now we add our three. So answer is three and one third. To show you work, you could do what we just showed you, or you could draw a visual like this. So there would be six families. So here's a family. 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 And here's another family. So we have all of our six families. Now, we also know that there are 20 pizzas. So one pizza, two pizza, three pizza, four pizza, five pizza, six pizza, seven pizza, eight pizza, nine pizza, ten pizza, eleven pizza, twelve pizza, thirteen pizza, fourteen pizza. 15 pizza, 16 pizza, 17 pizza, 18 pizza, 19 pi pizza, 20 pizza. We're gonna give each family three pizzas to start. So here's a, here's a pizza for this family, another pizza, and another pizza. Let's go to the next family. One, two, three pizzas. Next, pi next family. One, two, three pizzas. The next family. One, two, three. And the next family. One, two, three. And this family goes to this one, this one, and this one. And now we have two pizzas left. So now we're going to split them into thirds as a guess and check. That was...
doing TSSA review with Samantha and Winston. Okay, that's good. Now let's just give each family one third. So here's one third for a family. Here's another third for a family. And this family is going to get the last third on this pizza. This family will go to this pizza, one third there. This family will go to a third over here. And this family will go to this third. Now we'll. So we know our answer is three and one third. So now we have to make, to check that it's right, we have to make sure it's one of our choices. We have five twenty fourths, three tenths, and three and one third. So we know that three and one third is our answer. For this, C is our answer.